Countries of the United Kingdom The United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland, UK, since 1922, comprises four constituent countries, England, Scotland, and Wales, which collectively make up Great Britain, as well as Northern Ireland, variously described as a country, province, or region. The UK Prime Minister's website has used the phrase countries within a country to describe the United Kingdom. Some statistical summaries, such as those for the 12 nuts one regions of the United Kingdom, refer to Scotland, Wales, and Northern Ireland as regions. With regard to Northern Ireland, Scotland, and Wales particularly, the descriptive name one uses can be controversial, with the choice often revealing one's political preferences. Although the United Kingdom is a unitary sovereign country, Northern Ireland, Scotland, and Wales have gained a degree of autonomy through the process of devolution. The United Kingdom Parliament and British government deal with all reserved matters for Northern Ireland, Scotland, and Wales, but not in general matters that have been devolved to the Northern Ireland Assembly, Scottish Parliament, and the Welsh Senate. Additionally, Devolution in Northern Ireland is conditional on cooperation between the Northern Ireland Executive and the Government of Ireland Sea North slash South Ministerial Council, and the British Government consults with the Govern. 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 England, comprising the majority of the population and area of the United Kingdom remains fully the responsibility of the United Kingdom Parliament centralized in London. England, Northern Ireland, Scotland, and Wales are not themselves listed in the International Organization for Standardization ISO list of countries. However, the ISO list of the subdivisions of the United Kingdom, compiled by British Standards and the United Kingdom's Office for National Statistics, uses country to describe England, Scotland, and Wales. Northern Ireland, in contrast, is described as a province in the same lists. Each has separate national governing bodies for sports and compete separately in many international sporting competitions, including the Commonwealth Games. Northern Ireland also forms joint all-island sporting bodies with the Republic of Ireland for some sports, including rugby union. The Channel Islands and the Isle of Man are dependencies of the Crown and are not part of the UK. Similarly, the British Overseas Territories, remnants of the British Empire, are not part of the UK. Historically, from 1801, following the Acts of Union, until 1922 the whole island of Ireland was a country within the UK. Ireland was split into two separate jurisdictions in 1921, Southern Ireland and Northern Ireland. Southern Ireland became the Irish Free State and left the United Kingdom in 1922, left the Commonwealth of Nations in 1949, and is now known as the Republic of Ireland or simply Ireland. Key Facts Statistics Figures for gross value added do not include oil and gas revenues generated beyond the UK territorial waters in the country's continental shelf region. Terminology Various terms have been used to describe England, Northern Ireland, Scotland, and Wales. Acts of Parliament The laws in Wales Acts 1535 and 1542 annexed the legal system of Wales to England to create the single entity commonly known for centuries simply as England, but later officially renamed England and Wales. Wales was described in varying combinations as the country, principality, and dominion of Wales. Outside Wales, England was not given a specific name or term. The laws in Wales Acts have subsequently been repealed. The Acts of Union 1707 refer to both England and Scotland as a part of the United Kingdom of Great Britain. The Acts of Union 1800 use part in the same way to refer to England and Scotland. However, they use the word country to describe Great Britain and Ireland respectively when describing trade between them. The Government of Ireland Act 1920 described Great Britain, Southern Ireland, and Northern Ireland as countries in provisions relating to taxation. 
the Northern Ireland Act 1998, which repealed the Government of Ireland Act 1920, does not use any term to describe Northern Ireland. Current Legal Terminology The Interpretation Act 1978 provides statutory definitions of the terms England, Wales, and the United Kingdom, but neither that Act nor any other current statute defines Scotland or Northern Ireland. Use of the first three terms in other legislation is interpreted following the definitions in the 1978 Act. The definitions in the 1978 Act England means subject to any alteration of boundaries under Part Roman IV of the Local Government Act 1972, the area consisting of the counties established by Section 1 of that Act, Greater London and the Isles of Scilly. This definition applies from 1 April 1974. United Kingdom means Great Britain and Northern Ireland. This definition applies from 12 April 1927. Wales means the combined area of the eight preserved counties of Wales as outlined Section 20 of the Local Government Act 1972 as originally enacted, but subject to any alteration made under Section 73 of that Act consequential alteration of boundary following alteration of watercourse. In 1996, these eight new counties were redistributed into the current 22 unitary authorities. In the Scotland Act 1998, there is no delineation of Scotland, with the definition in section 126 simply providing that Scotland includes so much of the internal waters and territorial sea of the United Kingdom as are adjacent to Scotland. The Parliamentary Voting System and Constituencies Act 2011 refers to England Scotland, Wales, and Northern Ireland as parts of the United Kingdom in the following clause, each constituency shall be wholly in one of the four parts of the United Kingdom, England, Wales, Scotland, and Northern Ireland. Other official usage. The Royal Fine Art Commission's 1847 report on decorating the Palace of Westminster referred to the nationality of the component parts of the United Kingdom being represented by their four respective patrons, say. European Union For the purposes of NUTS one collection of statistical data in a format that is compatible with similar data collected in the European Union. Scotland, Wales, and Northern Ireland were regions in their own right while England was divided into nine regions. Current The official term rest of the UK RUK or RUK is used in Scotland, for example, in export statistics and in legislating for student funding. The alternative term home nations is sometimes used in sporting contexts and may include all of the island of Ireland. Identity and nationality According to the British Social Attitudes Survey, there are broadly two interpretations of British identity, with ethnic and civic dimensions. The first group, which we term the ethnic dimension, contained the items about birthplace, ancestry, living in Britain, and sharing British customs and traditions. The second, or civic group, contained the items about feeling British, respecting laws and institutions, speaking English, and having British citizenship. Of the two perspectives of British identity, the civic definition has become the dominant idea, and in this capacity, Britishness is sometimes considered an institutional or overarching state identity. This has been used to explain why first. However, this attitude is more common in England. Contrariwise, in Scotland and Wales there was a much stronger 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 identification with each country than with Britain. Studies and surveys have reported that the majority of the Scots and Welsh see themselves as both Scottish slash Welsh and British, though with some differences in emphasis. The Commission for Racial Equality found that with respect to notions of nationality in Britain, the most basic, objective, and uncontroversial conception of the British people is one that includes 66% of respondents felt the future should be as a part of the UK, with or without devolved government. 
17% felt that Northern Ireland should unify with the Republic of Ireland. 50% of specifically Roman Catholics considered that the long-term future should be as part of the UK, with 32% opting for separation. 87% of respondents identifying as any Protestant denomination opted for remaining part of the UK, with only 4% opting for separation. Of those respondents who declared no religion, 62% opted for remaining part of the UK, with 9% opting for separation. Following devolution and the significant broadening of autonomous governance throughout the UK in the late 1990s, debate has taken place across the United Kingdom on the relative value of full independence, an option that was rejected by the Scottish people in the 2014 Scottish independence referendum. Cornwall is administered as a county of England, but the Cornish people are a recognized national minority included under the terms of the Framework Convention for the Protection of National Minorities in 2014. Competitions and Petitions Each of England, Northern Ireland, Scotland, and Wales has separate national governing bodies for sports and competes separately in many international sporting competitions. Each country of the United Kingdom has a national football team and competes as a separate national team in the various disciplines in the Commonwealth Games. At the Olympic Games, the United Kingdom is represented by the Great Britain and Northern Ireland team, although athletes from Northern Ireland can choose to join the Republic of Ireland's Olympic team. In addition to Northern Ireland having its own national governing bodies, for some sports, such as association football and netball, for others, such as rugby union and cricket, Northern Ireland participates with the Republic of Ireland in a joint All-Ireland team. England and Wales field a joint cricket team. The United Kingdom participates in the Eurovision Song Contest as a single entity, though there have been calls for separate Scottish and Welsh entrants. In 2017, Wales participated alone in the spin-off Choir of the Year, 